The Institute for Clinical and Economic Review is an independent nonprofit organization whose mission is to help synthesize um, evidence for all different healthcare stakeholders. We help put together evidence reviews and work with public uh, processes to help health plans, provider groups, patients, and manufacturers really understand what the evidence says, both about clinical effectiveness, but also about the comparative value of different healthcare options. One of the tools that we use to try to help pull evidence together, but then make it understandable and actionable, is something that we call the ICER Evidence Rating Matrix. What this is, is it, it's a way to both structure an approach to an entire body of evidence and to describe how a judgment is made about what the evidence says on clinical effectiveness and how strong that evidence is. What's the confidence that decision makers can have in what the evidence says about the clinical benefits and the harms. So it ends up looking kind of like a grading system, but it's built out of different components that help um, pharmacy and therapeutics committees or health plans or provider groups and others try to structure the way that they analyze the evidence and then express what they think the evidence says and how strong it is. One of the ways that we've developed it is so that it can basically deal with whatever evidence you have that you think is relevant. There's always a level of judgment involved at the front end about which types of evidence will be admitted, but once you've decided that, and observational evidence is really being used much more often these days by decision makers, this matrix allows you to fold that in and to basically, again, analyze that as part of an entire body of evidence and to express the weaknesses but also the strengths and what it says about benefits and harms.